Now, here's your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Well, the final hours of September, which turned out to be really a very dry month. It was only really two days where we had any significant precipitation. Just under two inches of rain. It was about two inches below average as we take a look at uh, a spectacular sunset. Looking at Newport Harbor sun officially setting at uh, 628 this evening. So just a little bit from now and we'll switch over. Let's head over to uh, Lincoln right now with a nice sunset as well. With temperatures that are falling back into the mid to upper 60s after reaching the low 70s this afternoon. Currently 66 in Providence, Glendale, Burrowville, Smithfield, and Coventry. That seems to be the popular temperature just about everywhere. And down in Narragansett, a little cooler, but nice at around a 63. I don't, it's a mainly dry week. I don't see any high impact major storms or any kind of washouts or widespread precipitation. I mean, every now and then there's a shower, but it's a pretty quiet week ahead, along with uh, seasonable temperatures. I mean, the average high for this time of year is around 70. And notice a better part of the week. We're on either side of 70 each afternoon, though trending a little milder as we get into uh, Thursday and especially on into Friday. So temperatures pretty much where they should be for this time of year. Quiet across New England. Once again, very late at night early tomorrow morning a little patchy fog you get a area of low pressure storm system offshore that stays away and you see some scattered showers across uh, the Midwest and the Ohio Valley. This is associated with a, a weather system in the upper part of the atmosphere, but this stays away as well. So the net result is that we keep things dry this evening and, and right on through the overnight hours. All right, for tomorrow morning, like this morning, we do start with clouds and some uh, fog very early. Should lift by mid morning to mostly cloudy skies. So perhaps a little more in the way of cloud cover tomorrow compared to today, but we'll see some partial sun as well. 11 a.m. It's at 65. You work outdoors. Uh, it's a pretty comfortable day. Once again, seasonable temps, meaning most spots are in the, uh, the upper 60s for daytime highs. Uh, the wind light uh, northeast at 5 to 10 clouds, but it's not a solid overcast. So there'll be some partial sunshine. And again, these numbers pretty much where we should be for well, October 1st. We change the, the page to a new month tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow afternoon, hour by hour, looking OK with temperatures topping out uh, in the upper 60s by 6 o'clock in the evening looking at about 63. Once again on the bay, visibility re is reduced, you know, 4, 5, 6, 7 o'clock in the morning and some of that patchy fog, but I would say unlimited by 9, 10 a.m. The wind is light northeast at 5 to 10, waves of 1 to 3, high tide at Newport Harbor about just before 8 o'clock in the morning. Water temp is running in the mid 60s. All right, seven day forecast, quiet for this evening, not bad for tomorrow. Uh, Wednesday looks good. Thursday and Friday slightly milder with temperatures in the lower 70s. Days. The upside, the early call to the weekend is that Saturday is not a washout or even a rain day, but rather the chance for a passing shower. Temperatures in the lower 70s and looking at some sunshine for Sunday with uh, temperatures in uh, the mid to upper 60s. <laughs> a special shout out uh, to this special lady who's watching tonight. Uh, happy birthday, mom, 90 years young. Her birthday is officially uh, today. Uh, thank you for for everything, everything that you're doing. We had a great weekend and she's watching tonight. As you guys know, she watches every single news case. She could be a news director. We, she, <laughs> really, she actually tells you where it's raining. She will. Uh, she'll let me know. She'll send weather reports. You know, it's, ra it's raining. And when in your Cranston. tie's not straight. <laughs> she'll let me know if the tie doesn't match, if the tie is not straight, if it's raining in Cranston, as if I didn't have that technology already. <laughs> but uh, thank you. Oh, wow. So, we wish uh, you the best. You're, you're bold saying yeah. that. No, no. Happy she, birthday. Mrs. Petrarca. We love you. <laughs> All right, coming up tonight at 10 and 11, we're talking to a